I want to go back across uh, to Ahmed Shaheen and Vivek Karju who are still with us. Uh, Ahmed, uh, you have also been talking about the harassment uh, that you yourself have uh, uh, faced. Uh, bring us an account of what it's really like to be a journalist in a country which is known to be one of the most dangerous countries to work in. Uh, just to apprise our viewers, according to the World Press Freedom Index 2017, Pakistan stands at a dismal 139th position out of 180 countries. It's difficult to be a journalist at a place. The more important it is to be doing journalism there because it's important to do it. Uh, when it comes to uh, my personal incident, uh, in my incident, my incident was a little different from the other incidents because in uh, this in Taha's incident, um, I can almost predict what's going to happen. Miraculously, all the CCTV cameras are stopped, are not going to be working anymore. Eyewitnesses are not going to be present anymore. People are just going to go off the grid, witnesses and involve people. It will be lethargic. And in, at the end of the day, the journalists will feel there's too much effort to put in following the case and you can almost see what's going to happen. My case was a little different. When I was assaulted and uh, what I see as an abduction attempt, um, I was lucky. <laughs>